Hey guys, Brian here. I thought I'd show you uh, how I did this clutch install on this truck, which uh, was an automatic truck, and I'm doing a Cummins conversion. This is an 84. 84 has apparently had mechanical clutches. Uh, for this, I needed a hydraulic. I had the hydraulic set up for this truck, but normally, uh, where they bolt in the the 92s and 3s uh, they won't clear the bulkhead where they are so what I've done is hole sawed this as close as I could to the bulkhead wiring and I cut the bracket down a half an inch on the inside in order to get it all to fit and it does didn't have to move anything out here uh, this all gonna come off and get a diesel harness stuck on it out here uh, to make this all right and factory but uh, got it in there Here we are, pedals. Now you can see a little light coming through there, the bolts drilled for the bracket. Uh, did this all with it in the truck, big pain in the butt. So there's not much room in there, but you can kind of see. There's the bulkhead and the bracket just misses it uh i said cut the bracket down welded it back together and uh got it all in there so then i just bent this piece here in uh, and a vise and it lines up nice everything's in a pretty good line there uh, works good. No binding on the switch or anything. So, got this part of the swap done. It's all in there. Didn't have to cut anything up. Insulation's all still intact. So, pretty happy with how that turned out. Glad there was enough room. Didn't have to cut the, the main bracket. The saw hole does come through part of that where it's doubled goes into the firewall uh, the saw hole did cut part of that out but I don't think it's going to influence anything strength wise there's plenty of material there to hold that and hold that master cylinder uh, clutch really doesn't push down that hard um, I just put two of the four seven sixteenths bolts in it I don't know why it has uh, four anyway I mean, I got it, the braces against the double part of that wall up there, so it's not going anywhere. And uh, if I can break even one 7 16th bolt with my foot, uh, I don't know what that says about the quality of hardware, but it's not very good if I can break it with my foot. So I think just from a lawyer standpoint, they want to put plenty of bolts in it from the factory. Because they always get lawsuits if anything falls out, so they want to be sure that there's four chances for it to fall out before your clutch doesn't work. But I'm not that worried about it. I'm confident that I tighten them up, and it's not going anywhere. And even so, like I said, it's against the firewall, so it really can't push out anyway. But uh, just thought I'd share that with you how I got that done. Hope you enjoyed.